Samsung is finally doing it. Hey what's going on guys, welcome back to the channel, hope you're all doing well. Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 4 back camera specifications are out and we may get more cameras like the Galaxy S22 Ultra, not only the one which we are expecting before and it is now confirmed when we are going to get the first phone to get Snapdragon Edge and one plus processor. Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 4 is going to launch in August along with the Galaxy Z Flip 4 and according to the rumors we may not get any design change in the Z Fold 4 and there is one big reason behind it, cutting the cost to make it reasonable. We are hearing this news about a cost cutting and it seems like it is going to be true but still unlike until the launch. Before moving on if you like the content make sure to drop a like, subscribe to the channel and comment down below do you want 108 megapixel camera in Galaxy Z Fold 4? According to Dehoyer Kim, Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 4 comes with 108 megapixel male lens and it seems like Samsung will put Galaxy S22 Ultra cameras in Galaxy Z Fold 4 and this could be a potential reason for the Samsung to change the camera housing on the Galaxy Fold 4 which is the only design change. Also this set a male left periscopic lens which were included in the Galaxy S22 Ultra. The previous rumors were indicating 10 megapixel telephoto lens with 3x zoom and now 108 megapixel and it is also clear we will get 12 megapixel ultra wide lens on the Galaxy Z Fold 4. Meanwhile we also get to know when we are going to get the Snapdragon Edge Gen 1 Plus powered phone. According to Dehoyo Kim, we may see Snapdragon Edge Gen 1 Plus processor phone at the end of June or earlier July in China and now it is confirmed that Galaxy Fold 4 is going to launch in August so it will power Snapdragon Gen 1 Plus. Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 4 may come with the next generation of AMOLED display which may be called M12 OLED material which will help in more brighter display but it is not confirmed yet. But the thing which is confirmed Samsung is going to use UTG ultra thin glass in the Galaxy Fold 4 and this could be the first Galaxy Fold phone to have it. And there is a speculation of under display fingerprint scanner where even Let's Go Digital gives the sample image of how it works but it is not going to happen this time. Since Business Korea confirmed that we will get fingerprint scanner in the power button like the Galaxy Fold 3 and previous generations of Fold. So with that being said, if you came this far, drop a like, subscribe to the channel and comment down below. Do you want 108 megapixel camera in Galaxy Z Fold 4? I'll see you next time. Till then, peace out.